What's up? Hey guys, it's Ivan. In this video, I just want to show you how to create an experiment campaign on your Google AdWords account. Uh, so here I am in one of my accounts here on Google. Um, and here I have just this campaign, you know, getresponse.com. Uh, just basic, obviously, it's, it, it's, it's, it's not like my affiliate link or anything, but I'm just going to use this for illustration purposes. Um, now, for those of you that don't know what an experiment campaign is, is it's basically a split test campaign. So you may be thinking, why can't I just copy paste a campaign and then test the differences there? Problem with this approach is that if you do copy paste a campaign and split test it, um, if you use the same keywords, assuming you're not changing the keywords, which you can do in the ad group level anyway, uh, you'll be outbidding yourself on the keywords, right? So I can't just have a campaign, for example, get response. I can't just copy paste the campaign and have one campaign targeting Canada, another campaign targeting US, for example, with the same keywords, because then I'll just be outbidding each other and the cost will go higher and higher. So the only way to really split test things, like for example, over here, uh, if you go to your campaign level, uh, let me see, yeah, here, right? Um, if you want to change, for example, the bid strategy, or you want to change the location, or you want to split test the device, or you want to split test the network, you can do that without having to constantly outbid yourself with the keywords by using this tool, which is the create an experiment tool, okay? Uh, now, I'm actually saving you guys a lot, lot of time, because when I first asked how this can be done, uh, I asked the the, the Google um, the, the 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 Google chat support. They said there's no way to do it, right? So um, there actually is a way, and that is what I will show you here. So first thing you you need to do is click on the ads tab under any campaign you want to actually split test, either ads or ad groups. And then over here on the right hand side, right next to date, you will see this option says draft. So click on that. Click on create new, and then create a name. So I'll I'll I'll, I'll say you know get response. Uh, with like US targeting, right? Or what, whatever differentiation you want to do, uh, either bidding or, or uh, uh, targeting. So one of the things I do like to split test is actually the bidding method. There's maximize clicks, maximize conversions, CPA bidding. Um, uh, what is it? Um, uh, manual uh, bidding, et cetera, et cetera. There's so many and I have had different results and different successes with different uh, actually options, okay? So that is one of the things you could also experiment with and test here. So after you do that, you click on create and then it should take you immediately to this old drafts section. And then from here, what you can do is change whatever you want to. So as soon as you click on that drafts and you, and you make your campaign, over here under settings, change whatever you want to change. So for example, in here, right, I can change, for example, my uh, bid strategy. Uh, so here I can change it here, for example, to, so I've had success under various campaigns under target uh, CPA. Under others, I had success under maximize clicks. Uh, enhanced CPC, I actually haven't had much success with um, after I got my campaigns rolling. But again, that is something you can experiment with and test out, okay? So you can change your stuff here. So, I mean, let's let's just do it right now. Let's click, um, let's click, uh, well, we don't know. Here, I'll, I'll just put on maxim, uh, manual CPC and then let's change the country here. Your last change won't be saved. Uh, let's make this United States. So I'm going to add US and I'm going to say remove Canada. Um, okay, so let me just click save there. I didn't click save on the other one. Manual CPC, I, I forgot to click save. Okay, so here's what we're split testing, right? We have one, the, the other one, my main campaign is for Canada and it's for maximized clicks. This one is for manual CPC and for United States. So now that we've done that, we can click on apply. We're gonna have two options. One is we can either completely update our existing campaign. So our existing campaign was running for Canada and for maximized clicks. If we choose this option, that's gonna be completely kind of deleted and changed to these options we have here. Or what we want is we want to run an experiment, okay? So that's the main point of this is we want to split test and see which one does better. So then we'll click on apply, enter a name. So um, let's click, let's say something like get response, US plus manual CPC, something like that, you know, make it like, um, this is just for your reference, right? Make it easy for you to know what this campaign is about. You can enter the date. So I can enter, for example, September 4th. So I can make it start today or I can make it start tomorrow. And, you know, as with split testing features go, it can be 50-50 or 60-40, et cetera, et cetera. So this is how much the experiment will get, okay? Experiment is the percentage of your campaign's budget that allocated to your experiment and odd auctions, et cetera, et cetera. Um, 
one thing to keep in mind is you can only have two experiments at a time. So what I mean is not two experiments, um, like two versions at a time. So you can have the main campaign and the experiment. You can't have a bunch of different experiments. You can only have one experiment or two variations at the same time. So after you do that, you click create and that is it. So now it should be creating for you over here, right? Um, and after that's done, what you should be able to do is you'll be able to click on it. So let's just click on that one. Uh, sorry, let's go to old drafts because it's still being made uh, and we'll click on uh, get response with US targeting. And as you can see now here, um, so the ads approved, everything's ready and good to go. So it should start running. And then after that, you should go to all experiments. So as, as, as soon as it kind of, um, as soon as it starts running, uh, you should be able to also see statistics when you go on this page. So at the top of this page here, when you click on, uh, you know, all, all experiments and you click on your uh, campaign that you've experimented, you should see a tab at the top saying uh, what the difference is uh, between your variation and your original campaign, how many clicks, how many impressions, how many conversions, et cetera, et cetera. So uh, absolutely, this is uh, useful for you if you have the conversion set up, then you will see that information and you will see, hey, which one's got higher conversions. And that way you could do, suppose, this variation, right? This one is the one with US targeting and manual CPC, right? And again, let me just show you, uh, just so you uh, understand that 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 this is what we've done. This one, the original one, which is running right now, right? It's approved, but I've set the budget super low, so it actually doesn't show because this is just trial. Um, this one is Canada and maximize clicks, okay? And again, if I go to all experiments and I go to all experiments here and I go to get response. Uh, this one here is US and manual CPC. Okay, that's exactly what we want. And um, what was I going to show you? Right. So, so after you do that, what you can also do, uh, so this one's under review now, right? They're just reviewing, making sure everything's the same. That's fine. Uh, you can click on apply and right, at, at, assuming a week or two or three or four or whatever time period you're happy with this split test passes, um, you can either update your original campaign, so you can just immediately change your original campaign and delete the old variation, or you can just create a new campaign and pause the old one, okay? So after that, these are the two options that are available. So that's really pretty much it. That covers it, and you should have this experiment up and running for whatever uh, field you want, um, whatever part of the settings you want to experiment with. Again, device, country, uh, or my favorite is this um, uh, bidding method. Okay, so that's up to you. So I hope this was helpful for you. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below. Uh, I'll be more than happy to help you out. Uh, other than that, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave it a thumbs up and subscribe. We cover a lot of different online marketing tools, tips, reviews, how to's, tricks, strategies, etc, etc. Thank you so much, and I will see you in the next video.